Hey, how's it going everyone? DarkFox36 here. I've got a uh, Commander Ike for uh, the uh, next run here, and uh, he'll get us started. Yeah, hi, welcome to SCM, of course, and also the end of No Wrong, the first week of No Wrong Warp November. This is a very special month where the only valid runs are No Wrong Warp runs. Uh, next month is Don't Wrong Warp December. Uh, followed by just don't wrong warp january so we're on a a trilogy so to speak or a trinity of really cool months and i'd like to uh continue that represent the month uh i'm joined by commentators to help me talk through a really really meme route that's uh yeah, ali yeah. hey guys and Vic. Ali, i've uh oh sorry run this uh around this route a bit I'm happy to be here to help uh, i commentate and of course Vic. Vic? Hello? <laughs> Hello, Vic. Damn. We lost him. We can't do this without Vic. We, we, the, the meme wouldn't be complete. Um, Does he not have permission to speak for some reason? Hang on a second. Let me... Oh, yeah. He might be getting Let that. me give you the runner roll. You have the runner roll. I have no this idea. This happened last year as well. With Did it really? Yeah. He has the right role, so oh, I can't, oh, didn't tell you. Well, He's in on deck. You can f start the run if you want. And Well, okay. actually, hang on. Hang on a second. I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> in the meantime, we can talk about... Um, a really cool part of this run is that we start with Bandit. Instead of Thief. Yeah. Feels weird, man. Yeah. And that means that we uh, get to do two short asylum if we get a double hit on the plunge. Oh yeah, I could die to hold this. That's fun. Yeah, he can. Hello. Oh, hey, hey, there we go. go. Hello. Discord was memeing me. Sorry. It's okay. You wanna introduce it's good. yourself? So I'm um, Vic, and I ran this route uh, two years ago, I think. Okay. And, uh, yeah, I don't have much else to say. We can get the run started. Um, time in, uh, on go. Three, two, one, go. Good luck, Ike. Yep. So, hopefully we get some stick drift. Okay, never mind. So, one thing you'll notice <laughs> is it will absolutely manifest itself in this run. If the camera flies up for no reason, it's because my controller is experiencing, it's experiencing shift drift. Sh stick drift, excuse me. Um, and so that will be a nice, fun meme. Uh, that's added on to the already memeiness of this route. Um, yeah. Yeah. So, I guess we should probably explain, uh, what this route actually is. So, it's, it's called Axe to Axe, and basically the idea is to start as Bandit, so we can use the Battle Axe, and then we'll transition to the Great Axe for the rest of the run, so it's Axe to Axe. Get it? Just because yeah, it's like mm -hmm. not one axe but two axes, Mocha Giga. Yeah. The reasoning behind this route is not having to farm for a Black Knight weapon. Because in this category in, pati uh, in particular, it's pretty hard to be fast without those weapons. Yeah. Yeah, spoiler alert this route isn't very fast. <laughs> yeah, this route isn't very fast. Yeah. There's yeah, some shit stick there. drift, yeah. Oh, here we go. Boys. Yeah. It, it it seems to happen when I'm mashing a lot, so... I'm excited. Alright, these hollows can be terrible. We roll there so this hollow can hear us early and hopefully... Oh, yes! Okay, that I like that. That was really good, actually. Let's hope we get the double hit on the plunge. Yeah. Let's see if you get the Pogus fight. There we go. And this is a pretty um, cool fight. We could just mash R2. Nice. The, the reason that works is because um, if you do a jump attack, um, Asylum actually gets hit by the jump attack before the plunge. So you deal a bit of extra damage. And nice the hollow. battle axe just, just deals so much damage that you can just two shot him afterwards. So. We're gonna open the key settings here while we jump to hopefully, yeah, uh, we can block a 
banner message that says something about Lordran and bonfires from coming up, and that allows us to sprint uh, earlier than normal. Uh, I don't know why I rolled that. Um. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice job. That was not stick wow. drift. That was my fault. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, you should have blamed stick drift anyways. Yeah, I could have. <laughs> yeah. Blame stick drift on anything. On so, a really cool thing about this run is that there are several suboptimal soul pickups and times when you have to use the souls. So, there's one of them. Um, and we need to do this so that we can most mostly so that we we can afford a green blossom, so that the needle fight isn't a nightmare, or more than it already is. Yeah. Um, so yeah, like if you you abso ahead. you absolutely save that time back with green blossom needle. Like you definitely save more. Oh than yeah. Time you lose. We get the S stock for a move swap glitch, which uh, one of my commentators will explain later on. Uh, yeah, Jeopardy we'll explain one. it when we first use it. We'll use it uh, before Iron Golem. Yeah. Anyway, here's the third suboptimal soul pickup. The third, and not the final soul pickup of this route. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot you pick up the uh, two incense as well. Yep. Um... So this dragon, this drake has been memeing me lately. Sometimes he doesn't shoot lightning and he just walks, but there you go. Yeah, I think it happens if you toggle. Some Probably, point. so that's why I was trying to toggle early. Um, luckily we don't have to do any quit out memes here, which you do have to do for BKH no wrong warp, at least to be optimal. Um, although you could you could die to the drake, so that happened to me in my NASA run. Um, off this ladder. Yeah, I uh, climb up a ladder to get the red tier stone ring, which is a ring that increases your damage by 50% when below 20% health. It's yeah, these tricks are very useful. pretty hyper. I'm In not, I'm a little scared to be honest. I might super peach it. Oh gosh, I think I'm fine. Yes. Yeah, you're fine. Uh, we got stick drift twice there, by the way. <laughs> nice. Wow. <laughs> Gandrigs. Gandrigs, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, I guess I'll do the up warp for no reason, just to show it off. Um, so basically you activate that elevator and then, um, you fall down the shaft to store your position up here at the top of the elevator, but you quit out before falling down the shaft to hit a kill plane, uh, so you end up not dying. Uh, it saves time IGT, but... I just wanted to show it here. Yeah, it's, prob it's probably still a tiny bit faster RTA, maybe. I don't know. I just know that you can't use the souls on the elevator because uh, you would lose them when you prompt swap. So there's literally no way to optimize this run. It's just a curse. So in the fastest route for this category, you would uh, make that black knight that just tried killing Ike, you make him fall off the cliff and hopefully get his halberd. There's a 25%-ish chance of him dropping that. 25, but you can use humanity and it goes to like 26, which is a huge difference. Yeah, I think it's 20 to 26, something like that. Um, so yeah, he's uh, oh, gonna make his, uh, yeah. it's gonna make his way to Andre, and he's gonna perform a glitch called Prompt Swap, where basically it's, um, you take advantage of the fact that the game's a PC port, so you place your mouse cursor over one of the arrows in the merchant menu, and press A or X on the controller and left mouse click at the same time, and that allows you to carry the confirmation box over to another set of items, which lets you buy quantities of items that you normally can't afford. So we're going to do that to get a lot of Titanite yeah. shards. And I hope I don't mess up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. I messed fine. this up recently. Okay, there you go. 
And here comes the super suboptimal <laughs> soul popping. We have to do it three times here. And meanwhile, we can see how many times the camera flies up. It already happened once. Oh, wow. Hopefully 12. Yeah, hopefully. Oh, now it's happening as soon as I rest the bonfire. All right, and so we got Sen's Gate. Um, I'll let you guys explain it, but um, I'll mention we're gonna use the Arrow Strat. Hopefully, we could shoot one. Of the, we can shoot a Hollow here and aggro him so that it saves time. Except I'm being very careful about it because controller aim is terrible. Yeah. And yeah. Do you missed. want me to ex do you want me to explain SGS, Vic, or do you uh, do you want to explain it? Uh, yeah, explain SGS, and I'll explain move swap later. So. Basically, um, this is really bad. on a specific yeah, on a specific point of these stairs, there's basically um, a death cam you can trigger with the post animation, and basically in that state, the game essentially thinks you're dying, so it doesn't load new assets like gates or enemies. So, but, but because we're not going to be dead, we can just run into Sense Fortress and quit out, and that bypasses having to ring the bells. Yeah, I missed the arrow, and then I got a very slow hollow. But getting a slow hollow was kind of my fault because I uh, didn't aggro him correctly but it's fine um and normally you would quit out um to reset the death cam as soon as you walk into sends but we're gonna have to actually walk around and pick up a soul before we do that uh which makes the pathing kind of annoying but what do you know it's axe to axe <laughs> yeah it's so bad <laughs> yeah this um yeah. so we can spawn in and the snake can just kill us if we don't uh, roll correctly. Um, okay, that should be fine. I might peach this. Actually, no, I'm not going to. Because why would you? So, this area of the game is usually the most consistent in pretty much every route, but it depends on where you quit out after SGS. <laughs> Almost died. Um, yeah, I gotta wait for this boulder. I mean, I'm sure most people have seen Sense Fortress is a pretty autopilot y area of this game, so we should be fine. A nice meme that's coming up is for the RTSR setup. Um, normally, no wrong warp. You can just take the booby trap by jumping into the arrow trap that we're gonna see here after we quit out to reset this boulder. But because Bandit has so much vitality, you have to take an additional hit while you're blocking. So. Yeah, great one. One of the one of the greatest parts. It's one of the greatest parts. Ended. It's why we don't do thief, even though we technically could. I mean, it's Ooh. not because of that, but. It's kind of terrible cycles, but it's okay. be knife to axe yeah well i mean you would you could just buy the battle axe i guess you would you would still use the battle axe for yeah. golem anyway and there's the final soul that we pick up insane that's a curse. Axe to axe. That is it's, a curse it's a route that uses two axes with the name in fox um yeah, and we have to do some more suboptimal soul popping here. Yeah. We're gonna buy quite yeah. a few things from this merchant. Yeah. Yeah, I'm right. gonna buy the Great Axe, the main weapon for this route, and some green titanite shards to upgrade it to the magic uh, infusion. Yeah. Man, he performs a glitch called Quantity Storage to um, buy a certain number of uh, green titanite shards. So basically he stores a quantity of 90-something, uh, and then he uh, stores up a quantity, like a confirmation box, and that allows him to carry that quantity into the merchant menu and buy that number of titanite shards. Yeah, but we have Golem coming up next. Actually, Iron Golem is one of the easier fights in this route. Um, compared to Drake's having to do with the Drake Sword in RTSR, for example. 
This is kind of really bad RNG, uh, especially when I don't have enough stamina to hit Bob twice. I don't actually know if you have to kill Bob there, honestly, but I just do it. Mm -hmm. uh, just save. So you notice Ike has a different um, move set now because he did the move swap glitch. And now his battle axe has uh, the running attack of the ass dog. That's I why almost he got grabbed soft blocked him. Just... Okay. You can get soft lock if you're menuing there while the uh, victory achieve screen pops up, and I just messed up the menuing, I guess. I don't know why. Maybe because I was out of stamina. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do, nor is that what I wanted to do. Very slow. Um, and that, that is pretty concerning stick drift actually it's so bad and of course it's really acting up before <laughs> uh, for this marathon all right so we're gonna do uh, some leveling here. don't forget to don't forget to upgrade the great axe yep. by the way Um, I'm to. I have to move swap twice up here. By the way, feels weird, man. <laughs> um, I guess I'll do it after this. Uh, confirmation box dupe. Because I don't like doing yeah. it here. And uh, confirmation box dupes. Um, what you saw I just do is basically when you store up the use of a come on confirmation box and then go into your consumable um oh I, menu. My gosh. And use something like Nestor's Flask. Um, you'll still be able to like you get the souls, but you will use the item you selected instead. So you, you can just dupe it that way. This runs cozy and not scary at all. Well, I don't know what mm. makes you think that, but just wait and see. Yeah, and you got quite a treat. Yeah. And so this, has, this is actually the R1 for the Battle Axe is terrible for a Painted Guardian. So if uh, we get a melee Painted Guardian, I'm not going to have fun. But we did, so we're good. Yeah, you're fine yeah. now. Yeah. And Bandit doesn't have enough. Oh, I didn't hear it. Oh, long shake. I should have listened. You can dodge that with a visual, with a visual, with a visual cue or audio cue, but we're explaining the game as we're doing this, so cut me some slack. I'm just gonna heal. It's it's actually so bad. It happens every yeah, time I toggle. Is. Yeah. <laughs> and it's gonna happen on like ONS or something. Your attack Please will just no. completely miss. To be fair, ONS is. I'm gonna eat my words in two minutes. But oh, hold on. I have to listen. Um, to be fair, ONS is not terrible in this route, or at least it shouldn't be, but you know, obviously it's ONS, so it can still kill. <laughs> nice camera. Oh, I didn't equip the battle axe. I knew I was missing something. Yeah. Oh my oh, god, you. nice. Oh, that's really nice. terrible. I two-handed for no reason. I'm quitting out. I two-handed at the worst time. This is actually kind of monk, I guess. Oh, we're fine. Um, nothing to worry about at all, folks. Yeah, we're fine. Insane in the air equip to avoid the double menu. You cannot wield this thing with enough stats. Or with the current stats you have. Here's our first safety bonfire. Definitely not the last. <laughs> this, this one's definitely this one's definitely required though. Yeah. And hopefully this knight gives us an okay attack. Yep. We're doing that for RTSR setup. Um, Ornstein should die in two attacks. 
Um, Smo can be kind of annoying. Um, if we haven't mentioned already, Great Axe is one of the worst weapons in this game. Um, yeah. I almost don't want to. Yeah, the range is terrible. Yeah. It's pretty wide, though. It's pretty wide, but it doesn't do anything. Alright, let's see. Alright, got an okay opening. Nah, jump boys. That was not bad at all. Uh, it's actually very good. good. Yeah, good smoke. I wish I had that in my races. Or my PBs. Mm -hmm. I do have to yeah. roll this, though. I'm always so anxious for my secret attacks on Smo. We're not making the elevator because Smo's terrible, but whatever. Actually, maybe if we jump. Ah! Love it. Uh, oh, oh, nice, dude. I mean, I still have to pop this soul, so it's like whatever. Yeah, that was still clutch, though. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Oh, I almost quit out. <laughs> I'm like looking for the bone. It's like, oh yeah, I don't have a bone in this route. Uh, we shoot Guinevere, and we have to run at a certain distance here before we turn back, and I'm going to do the key setting thing again, hopefully. There we go. Skips a banner that tells you you now have the Lord Vessel, because it wasn't obvious already. Oh, nice. Ah, I hate not being able to drop things on that. Um... Yeah, it's 15 int and, uh... Yeah, and then the rest and endurance, yeah. Okay. We level up int here because we're actually going to be enchanting our Great Axe um, yeah. using Rickert here. <laughs> so, uh, we'll be, uh... The reason why I quantity storage those green Titanite shards is for this reason here. Oh, shoot, I have to... The reason for that is because plus 5 is pretty bad in mid-game to late-game. So you definitely want... Either plus 10 or some kind of infusion like magic. Bon just said I was enchanting. I appreciate that. Yeah. You know what's not enchanting? This run. Yeah, I mean, you, you jumped into the elevator, dude. Like the last second. That's pretty yeah. enchanting. But yeah, I feel bad for Wicked. Now that uh, the new all boss stuff is a thing. This is like the only route you'll ever talk to him in now. Uh... Well, ES Malus, but why would we ever run ES Malus? It's not like we're running a tournament yeah, ever yeah, again. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Um, I I actually like this part. Um, the movement's actually kind of cool. We have to kill a blow dart sniper to get a a purple moss clump, which uh, will stop our poison when we uh, do fall damage cancels into the uh, the pool. You guys want to explain what the fall damage cancel is? Uh, yeah, unless you'd like to, Vic. Uh, no, I prefer you to do it. Uh, uh, so, you explain it better. Basically, when you, you plunge onto a sloped surface in this game, you enter like this glitched, glitched out animation, which uh, and the game lets you roll oh out of that God, animation. Oh my God, I hate this game so much. And, yeah, you can actually iframe lethal fall damage if you time it correctly, which you saw I could just do. Go to the bottom of Blight Town. Then one of quite a few ways actually to negate full damage in this game. I have to equip the bow because the menuing in this route is also really bad. And I didn't get a chance to drop the hilt or the battle axe, so I just have these buffer items that I don't need anymore in my menu. Um, this is actually one of the better fights again. Um, it's probably the last better fight, so to speak. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, pretty much. Mm -hmm. The only good there's, fight yeah. of this route, actually. Yeah, now I'm gonna die, she'll give me the sword this. opener. Never mind. Oh, never mind, I missed an attack, because I'm terrible. Can I still kill her? Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Okay. Yeah. So you don't even need to hit three move swap attacks on her. Fire Sage Elevator click coming up. Uh, do I take the God Archaeus Bonfire? Nope, screw it. We're not doing that. Now I'm gonna die. Are you sure? <laughs> I don't... <laughs> I would take De it. No, dealing with a Niggy is just going to give me ES Malus, not like PTSD, so no uh, thanks. Uh, let's hope Mario has an X2 then. We'll just whatever it. 
So we situate ourselves on this slope. Uh, we we quit out enough times uh, until we fall down this slope. This elevator that we're standing on loads a little bit later than we load in. So if we uh, keep doing what we're doing, we'll eventually fall through this elevator. And hopefully we don't die by falling on a branch that's right above the uh, boss we're trying to plunge. But I think we should... Uh, I don't like this at all. I feel like I'm going to die. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Oh, why did you have to say it, Ike? That's unfortunate. I guess uh, the, I mean, it's fine. I don't have Brazilian. to... How did I know? Yeah, I don't know. Feels weird, man. It's actually kind of a bad death, but... Depends, like, it, I probably should have just quit so... out again. I don't know what I'm doing. Yep. Depends, like, it feels so bad with great attacks, though, honestly. It feels so it's, much worse yeah. than other weapons. I just need to get my souls... Yeah, I mean, worst case scenario, you can just dupe. It's not that bad. Yeah, am I supposed to... Am I supposed to take the bonfire now? Um, what do you mean? Should I take the Daughter of Chaos bonfire now? I mean, that's up to you, isn't it? I mean, uh, fine. You should, I guess. I guess. There's no reason not to, I guess. <laughs> At the end of the game, I'm just going to have so many bonfires in my warp menu. I'm just going to lose so much time. <laughs> All right, so actually, I'm just gonna heal, cause why not? Okay. Um, I guess I'll just do the same pathing as before. You can you can do the normal. You can, um, you um, can do both. Plans. I I have not practiced that in a while in a while, so no thanks. <laughs> Fair enough. I see a Bora Brazil spin. I really yeah. like it. Yeah, I'm Bora Brazil. I don't know why I almost rolled off there. Okay. Yeah, we'll take the bonfire. I would rather not die again. Honestly, I will say this. If that's the only death in this run, I'll be happy. <laughs> yeah. Um. I guess we need to remove swap though, technically, because you're not supposed to undo and your. And you move could swap. you could always do the placebo setup, then move swap. Oh yeah, be a. I doubt. I'm sure that works. <laughs> yeah, and what I mean by placebo is there are some people who believe that. Um, Doing like using the normal animations of weapons is a bit better than the S stock one. Oh, uh, it's never never fully been demonstrated. So I just realized we're go. not gonna have RTSR. I mean, it's fine. You should normally have RTSR for this fight. Nice sword roll. Just take a few extra running attacks. No big deal. Just, just, just can, I, can I kick with move swap? No, you can't. no. Like, you need to hold block to kick. It's yeah. I I just kicked without holding block, so you guys are lying to oh, me. But I appreciate dumb. it. Maybe. Although you, it's you, jump you, attack. You, you can't jump attack. Oh, yeah, it's yeah, the I'm jump trying. attack. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I was about to say yeah. All right, so I don't like that. I, see, now I'm just second guessing myself. Man, that should be fine. But the, the reason I wasn't sure is because with the S-Dock, you normally can't kick. Well, Kicks yeah. at Iron Golem? No, it has I have, I have kicked at Iron Golem before, actually. I'm quitting out again, because I usually do three. Yeah, the I've only kicked. boss I kicked was <laughs> Taurus. Yeah I've, yeah, I've done that. Uh, okay. Now, this might oh, nice. take a very long time. Man. So yeah, what you just saw him do was um, yeah, clip through the ground, because um, the uh, <laughs> elevator is actually part of the Demon Ruins area. Oh my Everything god! Everything is in quite large domain, so the game actually loads the elevator a bit later. Dude. So that's why we can fall through. <laughs> the slowest fire sage in the game. Also, something really nice is because um, we can plunge him from above, and because his AI is triggered by the fog gate, he just chills there. Let's just kill him. All right, so here's the actually hard boss. Yeah, yeah this is Monka Shake. Yeah, this is... I would expect to be here for a good five minutes. This is a terrible boss fight. Um, 
Yeah, range really comes uh, into a bit of a problem. Yeah, and not only that, it's just the RTSR setup is really suboptimal um, because y you can't have your armor on and still quick roll. Oh, I wanted to double humanity. You miss move swap here, it's terrible. That's exactly what I did, and I'm quitting out. Um, yeah, I used to quit out. There's like some insanely YOLO centipede. It's not YOLO, is the thing. You know, it is YOLO, what you guys used to do. Yeah. No, I just evicted. Blame him. Oh my goodness uh, gracious. I did what Duck told me to. I'm gonna run out of uh, Estus. Taking a hit on that fire is terrible. You could usually back it up in BKH, no wrong work, but once I oh, get no. it, it'd be nice. <laughs> I'm rolling too early. We haven't even gotten to the fight yet, by the way. <laughs> no. It's just the setup for the fight. Yep. Alright, maybe we can do move swap this time. No dude. I just I would I would I would still do it, but I not well, if maybe should maybe we should do the old setup at this point. What's the old no I'm not doing any old setup. We're 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 in here for the long haul. Uh, what yeah. do you mean, please? I'm trying. <laughs> this was no longer a problem with me. I used to be well to be fine at this. Oh my god! All right, fine. We'll oh, just. Dude. I'm dead. Yep. <laughs> oh, That's no. what happens when you don't quit out. Uh, this is so I frustrating. Maybe. Yeah. You're forgetting you have armor on, so you're doing. No, it too I had fast. this. I was doing this fine, like days ago. I'm just hitting it too fast now for some reason. By the way, that that attack happens if you move swap too quickly. Um, you like this run? Well, I'm glad you're enjoying it, because this is very infuriating. I'll be honest. <laughs> Yeah, must be noobs. I agree. It's the S stock and the longbow. Okay. Oh, nice dude. Uh, no, I'm oh, shit. <laughs> ah! <laughs> I did it again. <laughs> His position is so bad, man. It's fine. I can just um, I'll have to dupe Quailax souls. And the centipede, honestly, it's awful in this round. It's terrible, yeah. I didn't pick up the souls last time. Yeah, and I got a terrible opening from centipede, so... What can you expect? Like, like you can get messed up just by pure RNG, and there's nothing yeah. you can well, do. Well, I mean, that wasn't RNG. I was just, like, I was trying too hard, I guess. I should have played it safe. Now I don't have enough souls to upgrade, so I'll have to spam dupe the Quayla Axel. That should be fine. Yeah, I'm not sure how many you need, though. I think I, I had 60,000 before. So, oh, okay. So that's like eight. Uh, I think. That's quite quite a quite a few dupes. Yeah. What is he doing? It's actually oh, probably because I because I'm doing the refight. I mean, at least the damage is nice. Please don't die. Do, like, yeah, I'm dead. Magic damage he just, for no, just jumped no. away for no reason. Ugh. Yeah. And also, if you didn't know, when you do move swap centipede, the camera is like your one of your worst yep. enemies. If he jumps, then the camera will just <laughs> will just flip for no reason. Yeah, mix that with stick yeah. drift, and yeah. Yeah, there's no stick drift in this. This is just blame stick drift. Blame stick drift. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad you guys are entertained by this. I'm just I'm having fun. This is a a meme route. Yeah. Yeah, that's the point of this route. Yep. 
Oh, nice. We're back to take damage from that. So is, there, is there actually no backup if you take that is, I you would, I don't think so. Or at least I don't remember least. having a backup, but I don't, I don't know remember it. how. Well, to this do. stupid armor setup, I have I have no idea. I just I hmm. I, this was going fine in my practice runs. It it, it was it was bad, but it wasn't this bad. <laughs> Soon I'll have to turn on no death. Just gonna chill for a little bit. No! Oh my god! Oh, dude! Jump back! Wow. <laughs> yeah, this is this is this is classic centipede. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I mean, at least people are entertained, though, so that's good. No, it's wonderful. I mean, I'll probably go overestimate, but whatever. I mean, well, not whatever. It was like I'm trying, guys. I guess we'll turn on no depth one day, right? Mm -hmm. I'm not OOBing the centipede. I don't even know how to do that. Yeah, if only sauce. Oh my god, now I'm R1ing. Yeah, it's good practice for Sif. Oh, yeah. I still have to do a uh, Sif. Uh, this is just the start. It's gonna go fine. Yeah, I, I think it'll be fine. Oh, I'm dead. No, I'm fine. Uh, yeah, you, you should be fine. You should do like a roll attack or something. I know. Hallelujah. Hell yeah. Can we get some Frinkers easy in chat? Thank you, guys. I'm so glad that just happened. That was probably one of the worst series of centipede fights I've had ever since starting this run. Um, and we have to do eight Quailag soul dupes now, so that's even better. Mm -hmm. Also, the reason why Ike has got armor equipped for this run through is if you run through normally, you actually cannot survive the lava damage. That's yeah. another nice meme at this round. So if I miss the beta chaos, I will load a save file. <laughs> because yeah. I'm not, yeah, I can't afford to sit back up right now at this oh, rate. You, yeah. I mean, if you miss a bomb, you'll probably have to as well. Oh, yeah. And you have two. Yeah. Y yes. Well, it, it originally was not designed to be a meme. Actually, was it? Yeah, I guess it was. No, it was it's designed it. to be a meme round. Yeah, I'm sure. It's, it's, it's a meme, yeah. This route is at least five minutes lower, I think, over the compared to the fastest route. Yeah, for six, six, seven minutes. No. The real no wrong, no wrong warp because this would know better. Yeah, you can get like a low forty-four of this, and the world record's like high thirty-seven. serious thing to ever be a thing. I don't know about that one. Yeah. I, I, I do kind of agree, Benny, you know. But you are the one with the gun, so, you know. Don't know if that tells you much. Check out this advanced strafe on Guaylana. Try this one simple trick at home. Um, Dark Souls runners will hate you. Nice, dude. All right, let's hope this doesn't go terribly. Um, we already have prom swap set up. Yeah, it is Guaylana. It's confirmed. <laughs> it's yeah. not. It's not Guaylana. A lot of people think it is, but it's not. Yeah, no, you're Lara, bro. I might die. Oh, Do no. I need to explain what just happened there? We're loading that, a save file, oh, I don't care. Yeah. No. <laughs> that, 
So I'm that's actually that hasn't happened yeah. to me yet, and of course this is the first time that it happens. Oh, I loaded fire sage elevator. Cool. I, Sorry. I, I knew I knew something like this. That is so dumb, man. I don't even. Where am I? Oh, okay. So stupid. That wasn't a stick flick. That was a stick drift. It just happened at the right time. I have stick drift on my uh, controller. As of recent. Oh look, you got you got you got your soul, you got your souls back now. Nice. Yeah, I, Ooh, I yeah. didn't die a single Insane time. time save. I, I didn't see I could die ever. Yeah. In this run, in this run I mean. Yeah. Yeah, it was it was an optical illusion. Oh yeah, and I can die to firestorm too, that'd be cool. Yeah. No blossom too. I mean, I was never using a blossom. I'm gonna yeah, super no. peach nice. this at this point. Let's get stick no drift problem. again. Nah, not on the safe out of ten. Yeah, of course not. Just like after I aggroed aggro Andre in my tournament run, I had a perfect run after that, pretty much. All right. Well, we got past the hardest part of the run. Not really. <laughs> well, the hardest yeah, part, at least. There's still Nito. There's still Nito, and there's still uh, yeah. the incentive. All right, we're going to get to see the main event of this run. In the yeah. End. Thanks, guys, for donating five hundred dollars to save the children. But I hate you for making me do uh, <laughs> no move swap <laughs> save. Maybe that will be the best run so far in this in this run, though. We'll see. Or the best fight so far in this run. Yeah, the best part is that um, your RTSR setup can't be with this Titanite Demon, which usually leaves you with more than enough health. Um, so you have to take... We're going to take the Bonfire, obviously, but you also have to take the Consistent Knight hit. Um, which does more damage to you for RTSR. Um, so yeah. Hopefully it's not terrible, but it might be. That's right. Not gonna lie. But we won't have to dupe several souls if we die, because we have zero souls right now. Yeah. Just get the good attack, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, for yeah, those like, of you who don't really fun. know, for those of you who don't really know um, what the incentive was, it was uh, normally I'm doing all these fights with move swap, but uh, I'm actually gonna eat a humanity here. Um, uh, it was normally that normally I fight all these enemies with move swap, but the incentive was to. Basically, fight Sif casually with the Great Axe. Mm, nice yeah. setup. Yeah, it's alright. And maybe we'll do Ruin Skip, though. This is the most annoying skip in the game, probably. This is the, hard, this is the hardest skip in the game ever. Hardest skip in the see game. If he gets it. And we didn't get it because we're bad. Let's see if we can get the backup. Never mind. Ah, we're just bad in every single way. Now we have to quit out, and that was a really cool turn on animation, too. Hopefully I don't fall off this edge. Um, the reason why we're coming down here, by the way, is because... Uh, um, oh my god. I'm just having, like, I'm dreading the, the Nito fight, given how terrible the centipede fight was. Um, the we reason why we do is... Armor. Yeah, we get the stone armor because um, we want to have as much poise resistance as possible in the Nito fight because there are skeletons that hit us on the way. Um, I'd also normally jump down here to save time, but because I'm trying to conserve as much HP as I can, I'm actually gonna <laughs> go the the normal way. <laughs> um, all right, so this is the this is what everyone wanted. Hope you're all mm -hmm. happy when this uh, goes terribly. Are you happy, Ike? I'm so happy. <laughs> yeah, should have done the quit out for the extra spice. 
Oh, I should have done quit out, Sif, yeah. <laughs> yeah, let's see how this goes. Yeah, main issue with this is just that the Great Axe R1 takes us like 50 years to finish. I don't like this. I'm bad. Oh! Oh my god, he did a stupid oh, limp dude, move. Yeah. Why he just delayed yeah. that attack so badly? See, the, the ironic thing is, I was talking about this just before we went uh, live, this attack, and how I always get killed by it. Can I, uh, can I eat three start. humanity? I mean, I guess I can, right? Now I have to do Foggate skip, uh, Sif as well. Which is fun. Fine. Man. That's uh, that's even better. Yeah. Oh, the humanity. Uh, can I even get RTSR with this? Mm, I think you can. I think I have to take the extra jump. Sure, yeah, you should. You should okay. be able to get it if you take both mm, jump damages, I guess, or full damages, rather. Uh, sure. Yeah, you'll be fine. I'm so mad. That was almost an actually okay fight. Uh, the humanity gives us some physical resistance, um, which we're using for Sif because when he jumps on you, he can actually deal a lot of damage. Why, why are you going the normal way? Oh, yeah, I have no idea because I'm no. brain farting. Cool. Maybe the mushrooms will kill me. <laughs> yeah, AIK, please. I know. I'm gonna not menu on the fog gate, though. Alright, this is probably gonna be terrible. I haven't really practiced this. Can we get out of the corner, please? Thank you. Shake. Now he's walking. I hate you. Oh my god. The great axe walk, yeah, the great axe again. is so terrible. Can't boot oh, this I'm move. dead. You're fine. We dodged it. Yeah, I dodged it that time. Delayed the roll ever so slightly. <laughs> Hooray! Oh, cool. I have to warp to Firelink now. It's fun. Uh, I guess I'll rest at Firelink, right? Do I even want to try? I don't even know the sl I don't even know the safe setup for the uh, safe RTSR setup. Yeah, I have no idea how the RTSR setup yep, is meant to work. So. Here. you can do the uh, the boomer one. No, I'll do the steps. regal. The boomer one is nice. Do it for the yeah, boomers. Yeah, yeah, boomer one is super chill. That's what I meant. I'm probably dead here. Oh no, that was perfect actually. All right, and then we got four kings, which uh, I'm not very confident about, <laughs> given how the state of this run has been. Yeah, we also have seal skip, which is pretty cool. Oh yeah. So, basically, what you do is you um, take advantage of a slope cut out to get below the water level, and the way that works is whenever you land on a slope, the game's priority is to get you to the bottom of the slope before actually killing you. But if you quit out during that time. You'll end up where you landed without being dead. And when you do that, you can then approach four kings from out of bounds, which means you don't have to drain the water or anything. I'm kind of scared to do the move swap in the arena, because um, the centipede move swap is being so bad. I might do a save file here if I end up dying. We'll see. <laughs> Yeah, the thing is with four kings is that you um, 
because you um, deal damage to the whole uh, health bar as a whole, you need to set up the fight in a certain way if you want to get two kings. It can be a bit spooky. It's really bad with Great Axe, that's for sure. Yeah, it's really bad with Great Axe. But what isn't? Wailhug. Hmm. Yeah. And, uh... Nice stick bonus, drift as I'm turning golden. around. Why is he so far away? What? Oh, that's weird. Oh, and he's moving too. Oh, cool, I missed. So I'll um, drop another item because we have to do three kings. <laughs> three, three kings community, Bog. Yep. Oh, cool, and I didn't equip the Sif Soul either. Well, you have plenty of time to do it now. Uh, no, I don't. That's actually really bad. I'll correct it. I mean, after this game. You know. Oh, why did I? Why do I even care? I mean, I'm gonna have to do three kings anyway. And how are you doing it for the kids? Are we really doing the the attack now? Hello? <laughs> how long are you running for? What? <laughs> That's new. I'm dead. There's nothing I can do. I'm quitting out. I, I just kiss my ass. That was, that was super scary. Guy. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, this might be the worst run I've ever done, period. This is so bad. And we're going to drop so all our armor. No, this is perfect run, honestly. I'm having so much fun. Oh my god. I love this game. Is it, can this even get free kings? Yeah, I was actually wondering if you can. Oh, I have no get... RTSR. Yeah, that's yeah, what I mean. Exactly. I might actually. Uh... I think uh, yeah, you I might actually doing be like, just four kings. I might, do, I might be doing four kings. <laughs> oh, Real boss fight, man. Kings. Yeah, this is like really low damage. Why is he spawning so late? <laughs> oh yeah, keep moving, dude. This is actually really bad because the kings spawn at the same time. Oh my god, am I dead? I think I missed a hit on that. No, you got it. Actually, yeah, this this should be free kings actually. Uh, you sure? Yeah. Yeah, should be fine. Are you that, sure? If it's, if it's not free no, kings, I'm not sure. okay. Uh, I'm curious if this gives me RTSR. Yes, it does. Oh no! If only the first king did that. Wow, that was really clutch. Uh, we'll never know now. And now we have to take it the Abyss Bonfire. Very interesting <laughs> nice Abyss Bonfire. Well, this bonfire is essential. Yeah. I mean, don't, don't say no, by the way. Yeah. Honestly, I wouldn't mind. Not I wouldn't mind <laughs> saying no, because I don't want to continue. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll continue for you guys. You guys have been a great audience, and... Real good sports. Although maybe you've just been laughing at me this whole time, not with me. Maybe both. Yeah. Oh, I, I completely forgot the thief existed for a minute. <laughs> yeah, we still have that. <laughs> I mean, just keep him. Maybe Actually, I Ike, why did you why did you grab the abyss bonfire? Uh, so that I don't he have to do steel to... skip again. Ah, yeah, okay. He, he, he wants to take um the tomb of the giants bonfire, I think. Yeah. Yeah. 
And honestly, at this rate, I wouldn't mind taking the Catacombs bonfire either. <laughs> well, I wouldn't actually blame you for that one. Um, oh, I would. I almost died there. That was fun. Yeah, for anyone who doesn't know, Pinwheel is actually a boss in this route. I was just talking about. I was just talking about the plunge, but yeah, Pinwheel's a boss for sure. Uh huh. Just combine both of them. Easy. Hardest boss in the game. And this uh, area can also be kind of terrible. Depends on what these hollows do. I didn't die to the Chandler. Feels okay, man. Or I didn't die to the hollows jumping at me. Are you gonna are you gonna do the pog bow side up for Duke Skip? What? <laughs> I don't know what that is. Have you not seen? Have you seen it? No. Oh damn. Is that like a nah. old school it's... thing? No, it's new. It's a zoomer thing. Why did I roll off that? What am I doing? I'm sorry. I just it, that, 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 that actually that is a boomer strat I to do <laughs> rolls for Duke Skip. Hello? What the f- what is this? <laughs> this is hilarious. I think it's faster to quit out here, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, but yeah. Uh. Oh, it's slower to quit on RT? Okay, cool. Yeah. I'm I can do manly. Okay. Skip, let's go. I'm pretty sure oh, I can do manly time. drop now as well, or the at this rate we're doing the the peach drop. No, I go do the plunge, dude. No, nope, I am not doing the plunge. Ah, damn. Is that, is that because you're gonna, damn. Is, is that because you're gonna do slope quit out instead? No, I wish. And uh, it's bad, man. No slope quit out. Why not? <laughs> I wish I had as much confidence. Although we, you should be doing these these chain rolls. Only Regal and I do them, and oh, I think Mario does them too. I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, man. Funny rolls. Actually, wait. Do I die to the drop? What do you mean? Do I have enough HP? Uh... Yeah, I'm not fine. sure. Uh, Just don't take damage before the drop with the slope. And you should be fine. <laughs> yeah, everyone does them except me, we go. Remember, I, I actually discovered out of bounds here. Nice stored roll. Oh, yeah, I know which out of bounds you're talking about. So, yeah. Yes. Or and like if you, you can overrun do that out of crack it. that you fall through, you could actually fall into crystals and you're dead. Yeah. It's actually a place you can get stuck and there's nothing you can do to get out. Yeah. It actually pays to not take damage anywhere because you could actually die to see through. So. Yeah. It is pretty dumb to us. To be H. What looks dumb to me? Out of bounds, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nice cutscene. Oh my gosh. It clams the next time. I'm Should probably dead me. here. Yeah, see, see if it's actually really bad the next time. Like you can actually die. I would not be surprised if I'm dead. If he does the stupid explosion attack, I'm dead. But yeah, you, yeah. Nothing you can, well, yeah, nothing you can do. Oh my god, I tried quitting out. That's yeah, such a long run back. Do I just save file? Yeah. Probably should, maybe. Yeah. Like, see, see is honestly really bad in this Terrible. too. Terrible. Like, I've died to him as well. We will have to do the plunge. That's the best part about this, because the save file has low HP. I'm so happy. 
I get to show this off without this crystal oh, yeah. golem killing me. Does your save file have the uh, abysmal fire? Nope. But, I mean, at this rate, and... I'll just warp to the abyss bonfire with gadget. Because <laughs> I am definitely not yeah. opting to not take the... Uh... I've not died to that in such a long time. I'm sorry. Mm. <laughs> this run's going so <laughs> terribly. It's just a curse. <laughs> It's just, just, just the nature of the world. Yeah, this is what I get for not practicing. Well, I, I did practice, just whatever. Nice, fell on a slope. No, nice, uh, nice plus one S stop, by the way. Oh yeah, you can tell I really knew what I was doing in this route back then. Although I still don't know <laughs> what I'm doing. How did I get a clam? I, I don't understand. Yeah, this is what you get for doing extra X goofball. I'm glad we can still kind of make the run fun to watch. Yeah, it's all the all the matters in the end of the day. Yeah, I mean a lot of it is the route being terrible, but a lot of it is just me not playing correctly. <laughs> so that's fun. I think what happened was I stopped sprinting for some reason, so I won't do that this time. Or honestly, since I'm already saying that I'm going to commit to the save file-ness of this route, maybe I just won't even take the bonfire for Nita. Yeah, dude. You could do like pocket skip and stuff. <laughs> oh yeah, that's true. Go, go for everything. Oh no, it's like perfect seat this yeah, time. Yeah, it's a perfect seat. Once you go save file, you never go back, guys, so... Yeah. Do I have to level up here? No, right? No, you do. You what? do have to level up some you do. Unless you want to do... Oh, I level up HP. Yeah. Yeah. Well, do I... Do I... I sell bone? Oh, I don't have a bone. Cool. <laughs> I go, where's the fire link then? Yo, pinwheel. Duke the bone. <laughs> and then level up. Oh, yeah, this is just very, oh yeah. my god. <laughs> this whole yeah, thing. This is, this is amazing. Hey, it's better than forgetting to rest at Firelink in an all bosses run. Yeah, this that's part. true. Yeah, it is literally the live spliced run or the segmented run. <laughs> Yeah, if, if I ever beat my unbeatable world record, I'll know why now. This is a nice little shift from the runs I usually do. I'm usually way too serious. And of course, I'm serious about being in this marathon for sure, but can't be serious without laughing at yourself a couple of times. So, I mean, this is a non-serious route anyway, yeah. to be fair. I think the, the 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 point obviously is that we're all here and we're all doing this for a good cause, so that's what is most important here. Not necessarily how well I play the run. As long as it's entertaining. In Dark Souls it's not hard to be entertaining when you're bad. Yeah, you you're gonna do the YOLO roll here? <laughs> I almost hit that skull, so a monk shake. This is also terrible. I'm gonna get like four of these guys. Yep. I love it when they oh all aggro. God. Now I can do RTSR pinwheel. Oh, yeah. oh awesome. I actually, actually get a good pinwheel now. If I can move swap yes, correctly. Was all intended. Although maybe I should heal. I don't want to die. Oh no, no, I don't even get RTS. Oh, I do. Okay. Is that actually two shot? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It oh no, it's a one shot. Yeah. Wow, really? I don't... Okay. Yeah. Alright, so... A lot of people don't know there's a cameo from the Speed Souls community at this part. Um, I'll, I'll uh, explain it as we go along. So if we look to my left here, that's actually Sastutin. He's a very good any percent runner, and he runs force quit now. Say hi to him. 
Yeah, and he, he just chills in Tomb of the Giants. Yeah. Oh, nice. We don't even get this. Well, it's... You can, you can get hold in one, though. Nope. Nah, Dude, funny story. Doing... So, Vix PB, he yeah, missed that uh, jump uh, and then uh, didn't... Oh, the Black Knight died. <laughs> really cool. No, um, no, no Halbert. <laughs> no Halbert, yeah. Um, so, Vic died there because he didn't realize that he could do the backup. So, he missed that jump and then just had a panic attack and ran all around and died like 15 times there. Yeah, it was quite fun. Yeah. All my PBs are very entertaining. Yeah, Vic is also So my for... brain just turning into a potato. Or your PC turning into a potato in the credits work. Yeah, that, that also yeah. happened. Yeah, yeah, yeah Vic, Vic actually for... has credits world record in this game. He, ran, he tried running he any percent, he did unbeatable. SGS, quit out, and then the game just warped right to credits for some reason. We don't know why probably never know why so shout out to regal for teaching me this plunge like yesterday oh yeah um, you mean the one on the right make sure this is indexed this is kind of a terrible fight so if i die then i'm sorry oh cool we yeah, took damage it. i was gonna say it's a nice plunge but yeah yeah never mind regal you've screwed me over all right so yeah. it's actually not terrible rng so oh i need to actually And I get hit by that, it. even though I oh, poised no. it. Oh, you're definitely gonna need to heal. Oh yeah. Oh, actually, extra. I'll just heal when he does my asthma. Uh, I guess I healed three times there. Oh, how am I? How am I down? Because <laughs> how much? How uh, many hits you took from skeletons? Okay, whatever. It's probably one of the better fights of this run. Yeah, this was pretty fine. Pretty fine, yeah. That's a good way to put it. Oh, nice. So, beware the splice that's about to happen right now. How the hell do you warp with Gat? There we go. It gives you the bottom part of the list. I can't find Firelink Altar. Yeah, it's really hard to find. I think it's like in the oh, here it is. Okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. oh, that's weird. We just ended up here. Yeah, this is, this is you know, this is where we were meant to be anyway. So, you know. Yeah, let's just do Calamity too. We might as well do the DLC. Yeah, A A O T A Axe Twax. Yeah. Mm, so don't, if you know, don't say the word ever again. <laughs> <laughs> they will haunt me tonight. Lost Just thinking about way. AOTA <laughs> with Great Axe. Oh god. So oh, if you notice, I equipped the ac I equipped the, the the stone gloves here to survive this guy's attack. And now we're doing move swap Gwen, which is probably not going to work given my track record with it. Um. It's very inconsistent, boss. But I will move swap early so that I don't die. That's for sure. Yeah. Don't forget how you could be gloves. Thank you. Guys it does. It, 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 do, it does. Gan. It has nice quite log. It has nice ONS as well and Iron Golem, but. Pretty much nothing after that. So many things just went wrong in this run. But it's okay. So many things can still go wrong in this run. Just believe in the heart of the cards. Yeah, that's all, that's all you need. Yeah, let's not spam Frank or Z until I kill Gwen, thanks. No, spam Frank or Z so he can kill Gwen. Keep spinning. Always spin from Kanji. I'm gonna quit oh, out because no. that was really bad. Yeah, you definitely wanna quit out there. Yeah. There's one of the reasons why Great Axe sucks. Although that may have also just been because I rolled badly. 
I rolled too late. Oh, he, oh, he also did like Yeah, you, you kind of rolled pretty badly. Blame stick drift. Yeah. This whole run's going poorly because of stick drift. But that was a nice win fight, so. Yeah. Oh boy. <laughs> what can I say? Prime axe to axe run right there. And time. Yeah. So. G -g 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 -g. Yeah. So actually, we'll do. Part of this run is actually getting New Game Plus. So, no, I wish. <laughs> um. Thanks guys for watching. I um I'm curious to know what the time was. Uh second place, let's go boys. <laughs> yeah, second place, real. Um I'm curious well I'm curious to know what the RTA time was. Um if someone has it. And the RTA time was one oh seven forty five. Alright, so apparently. two minutes two minutes above estimate, so sorry not, about not, not pushing everyone back. It's not horrible. Um thanks guys for watching. Um, I would not recommend running this route, but um, it's no wrong warp November, so run BKH. Um, run anything that doesn't wrong warp, to be honest, um, and you'll be successful. If you guys want to learn, obviously go to Speed Souls, Discord, and stuff. Thanks again for having me. This is the second year I did SCM. I, apolo I, I don't apologize. I appreciate um, that everyone... Uh, took the time to watch this run and uh, I'm looking forward to hopefully doing this again next year. So thanks guys so much. Uh, I'll throw it over to you, Dark Fox. And thanks again, Ali and Vic for uh, commentating. Yeah, no problem, dude. Yeah. Thanks for inviting me, Ike. Yeah, of course. Awesome. Thanks guys. Well, we'll be back in just a few minutes with uh, Sekiro. Uh, I think this is going to be a randomizer full shuffle. So that's pretty awesome. So stay tuned for that and uh, catch you guys after this break. See ya.